hi guys so today we are going to learn about another effect handler in side effect that is snapshot flow so as you know we are making a series on side effects in jetpack compose and the effect handlers we use to for the side effects and uh, today is the last effect handler we are going to learn that is snapshot flow so what is snapshot flow basically snapshot flow is a uh, um, uh, we use snapshot flow when we want to convert a composed state into a flow for example if you have a scaffold state if you have this remember lazily state or another, any other kind of state you want to convert into a flow then we use snapshot flow so to understand this we have to like le let's just make an exam show with you an example i'm going to create an example and also guys if you haven't checked our previous videos on side effect all the parts you can go and check and you will learn about side effects in jetpack compose so here let's start with an example and and also i'm going to uh, put it on github so you can uh, check with for all the examples we till we uh, till now we have made you can go and check about all the effect handlers and side effect in, uh, side effects in jetpack compose so the today's example is for snapshot flow so let me make this uh, snap shot flow demo and let's just create a file and in this let's make the composable function composable function that is snap shot flow example right so let's make this an example so uh, basically snapshot flow we we are going to use whenever if you want to convert your state into a flow and you want to collect that is as a flow then you are going to use a uh, snapshot flow so here what we have is like we have a uh, scaffold state so scaffold state and you can take it as remember scaffold state right and yeah so now we are going what we are going to have we are going to have a launch effect and this as you know the key will be our scaffold state which we are having so because it is going to launch effect as you know it is it need a key on which according to which it is going to change and for the block let's have a block of code slender here and how we are going to collect as a flow so what you have to do is you have to use snapshot flow right then we are going to use it like this scaffold state dot snack bar host state as like if it is going to show us the snapshot flow as you know if it can show us a snack bar host state like the message when it's going to show the message or something like this and for this let's for let map it map uh, you can use map or you can use map not null if it is not null then you can use so we can use map not null and we are going to use it as it dot current snack bar data and dot message whatever the message is coming and then we are going to use distinct until changed so why we use distinct until change so whenever the value is going to change it is going to collect the data and otherwise it is not going to collect the data as a flow so here you can use the message whatever message is coming and just we can use the print and and we are going to use like we are going to show this is the message Right, so this is how you can use uh, your snapshot flow to convert it into a flow and it will work like this. So 
this was uh, this is how you can use the snapshot flow the uh, one of the effect handler in uh, side effect in jetpack compose as also you can see in the official documentation like they have used the remember lazy list state and uh, in the lazy column and it's the state of the uh, basically the list state and whenever the list state is changing we are uh, using it as a flow we are mapping the index first visible index and taking it and we are just filtering it and we are just sending it uh, collecting it as a flow so this is how guys you can use a snapshot flow and this is all about side effects in jetpack compose and if you want to uh, learn more about it go and check out all the videos which we have made on side effects and also guys thanks for watching and if you want me to make some videos on any specific topic in jetpack compose or in kotlin just do let me know in comments and we will make a video soon on that topic so this is it for today guys and keep watching please do like comment and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching bye